There was that stuff with Theo Vaughn. He was upset. Like, how do you deal with how do you deal with something like that? I've never. I'm happy that you brought that up. So I have never stolen any jokes whatsoever. But like, how do you handle that? Like, I don't think did. That- well, that particular instance, I, I think to myself, well, I don't understand why he would think that I I, I haven't stolen. You know, the, uh, to. Catch, I don't know if you guys are aware of the context of it. And I only recently am aware because I saw a comment that it said— It was just on the internet. and, and yeah. yeah. I think he was doing like a bar stool show. And you guys both had a similar idea in the show, right? Yeah. Where he had it in I something and, the, and then you had it, it on I a guess. podcast. He said it on a podcast. About the wooden then, shirt thing. Yeah, it was like a wooden shirt and then you guys had it in the show. Now, I remember when we came up with the wooden stuff in the writer's room and it was totally built on a different idea that was about like a one single, like a man whose entire house was made of wood down to the clothing. Yeah. And then it ended up, we ended up not going with that storyline. Yeah. Ended up doing one small, really inconsequential scene of my series where a guy was just selling wooden shirts. Yeah. I promise you it wasn't, I've never, and I, whenever I see content of Theo Vaughn's online as I'm scrolling, I totally think think it's funny and I respect it. Yeah. I've got no animosity. I've just never met him. We have so many mutual friends. Yeah. I always was under the understanding that like accusing a co- comedian of stealing jokes is like it's, a major taboo. It's, it's the deal. biggest, yeah. It's a big, so big deal. I, I was like, well, just reach out to me and let's talk because yeah. I've never, and I have nothing but respect from what I see of his content yeah. online, but I never have stolen any joke. That's really my immediate reaction. Yeah. It's not like, I'm not hurt by it. I'm just like, why would that, why would he... Be so insistent that I when I never would. Right, right. Two people can't have the same idea. It's a pretty broad idea, like yeah. the idea of wooden clothing. Yeah, I, I don't know. <laughs> like, I'm sure there. I don't know. See, it's kind of specific to the way you just yeah, said yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, yeah, yeah. You know, like, I'm not sure. Like, men and women are different. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Very one dimensional. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. But yeah, I. I I've have you of, guys spoken at all? No. Why don't you guys just talk? Why not? Yeah, I, I would. Because I think a lot of times what would happen in these situations is, you know, both sides explain their part and then you go, oh, okay, I see why this, you know, these two different comedians came to this conclusion and it wasn't sure. somebody that's no, trying I, to I, bite. I'm yeah. definitely down to, I have no beef with him whatsoever. I don't like when, you know, if, if I post something and I see like, stop stealing Theo's jokes, like, it's just, I don't, I'd never have done that. Yeah. And I think the, there's only one joke in question. It's yeah. not like I've made like a career, uh, you know what I mean? I don't even know what other jokes were even questioning. Yeah. Like three one. seasons of television. Right. Yeah. One joke. yeah, that's yeah, that's the thing. I think like now with the internet, there are so many more people putting things out that the possibility of two people having a similar idea is infinitely higher than back in the day where there would be 10 comedy specials a year. Yeah. And you just need to cross over in those 10. Now you have a million pieces of content that are out there in the world, and you're gonna see people with similar ideas. You see it happen with memes, you see it happen with you know written pieces, you see all these types of things. So I don't think it like immediately means that one person is stealing from another. All I know is that my soul feels very pure and clean. Like I, do I just think you guys are both great, and I would love you guys to both just be like, "Hey, set it up. You're yeah. friends with everybody." I, right? I will. Yeah. I will set that up. Yeah, I will set that yeah. up for you. Yeah, I will set yeah, that up. Great. Let's go on the you beach and post a with Brad. And remember, if you sign up, use that promo code Schultz. They will match your initial deposit up to hundred dollars. That means you put in hundred, you get hundred for free. Go to PrizePix.com.